Hello, hello my beautiful friends. How are you doing today? It's Farah here and I'm here with a makeup tutorial today. I was just getting ready to go to a dinner party and I thought that I would show you the look that I've created. I was feeling a kind of a cranberry-ish eye with these uh, bold mauve -y, ready lips and so if you like what I've created and want to know how to get this look, please keep on watching. I'm wearing the Claria Flawless Liquid Foundation in 03 and 04. Then I'm going in with my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. And then I'm just putting some Too Faced Shadow Insurance on my eyes. Then I'm gonna go in with some Estee Lauder Pure Color Envy in Cheeky Pink and I have never tried this color, it looks promising. I'm going for a pinkish eye, oh this color is so pretty, all over the eye. Take it up to the crease and then we're gonna go in with some more Estee Lauder Pure Color eyeshadow in Cherry. So I really love this color but I don't wear it too often because it's a very, very pink and very intense and to be honest I don't know where to wear pinks like this but I was feeling pink. Let's hope this works. So I'm just gonna put it in the outer V in your crease and bring it up into the crease and then just take a blending brush and blend it out. I always like to just add a little more whenever I need it, just spruce it up and then blend out again. Just to give the intensity that you want. And for blending, I'm using this beautiful Sonia Kashuk brush, which I love. Now, we're just going to define our lash line a bit. This is a pretty simple look. I'm just going to take a color from this Dior Quad. It is the Trianon edition. The quad is called Pink Pompadour. Very cute. And I'm taking this deep purple color, mixing it with some of that pink just to lighten it just a touch, just so that it's kind of in the same color palette. So just draw a normal cat eye wing, take it out as much or as little as you want to. You could even do it with liquid eyeliner actually. I just like one a lighter effect and with this color, it's gorgeous. So we have our wing there. Now we're gonna take this exact color down onto the lash line. So I'm gonna mix the two colors again from the pink pompadour palette and this color in cherry. So I've made it come down pretty low, which is what I wanted. And to blend it, I'm just gonna use that same blending brush and lightly, especially in the outer corners. Last, I'm gonna put some a long-lasting eyeliner of that in the waterline. It's a very, very beautiful goldy brown color. It's in the permanent line. But any kind of chocolatey browny or bronzy color will do. And what I'm going to do is curl my eyelashes and apply a light coat of mascara. This is the Maybelline Rocket. Just to get ready to put on some falsies, which is I'm going to be using, and they are the Star Jewel Lash in o, the 08 style, and I'm just gonna put on lashes, do the other eye, do my brows, and I will be right back with you. on. I'm gonna finish up these eyes by putting on some shadow in soft force. It's my favorite to put some in the inner corners of my eyes. And then I'm gonna go on to some highlighting. So I'm using NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in vanilla and I'm just going to make a triangle. There is a dupe for this that a friend of mine on here discovered which I really want to try. Her name is Aliyah and she does great reviews and she discovered a dupe. I don't remember what it is now. Is it Maybelline Masterclass? 
or uh, I don't remember but I will link it down below and you can check it out for yourself you can check out her review it's really great and so just blending everything in there we go so all blended in so now I'm just going to take on the tip of my nose and on my cupid's bow it gives a beautiful effect I just can't do my makeup without this trick now. Let's put some mascara on our bottom lashes before we go on, before I forget. By the way, if you like the foundation I'm wearing, it's this new foundation I'm testing. It's from this organic luxury brand based in New York and it's called Claria, Claria Cosmetics or Claria Cosmetics and they actually have asked if I want to affiliate with them and I said yes gleefully just going to put some mascara on the tops as well just marry my lashes with the falsies and so I'm affiliated with Claria Cosmetics and I'm testing out their foundation right now and I love it so far it's beautiful I, this is my first time wearing it I don't know how it will wear but I will probably be wearing it in more videos and so I will be able to give you a proper review once you know I've worn it through the night or you know for a few hours the, the wear and tear on this foundation but if you're interested I'll leave a link to their website down below in case you want to have a peek in case it piques your fancy. I'm really proud to be affiliated with them. Actually, it's my very first affiliation. Yay! All right, so let's get on with this. Now we're going to do some contouring. I'm using my angled contour brush. Take it right below your cheekbones. You guys know how to contour. I What I like to do is I like to take it a little bit down here. I think it gives my face personally a nice shape. I just like to take a little bit over my nose for that more sun-kissed bronze appearance, I find. And then just gonna do some blush. So I'm gonna go for a bit of a mauve ready with this lip color. So we're going to put a bit of color on the cheeks. So I'm taking this color from my NARS Adult content palette. I love this palette. You guys have seen me use it constantly. Just following that contour, taking it a little bit higher onto my temples and then back onto my cheeks and pull back. I find this shape works best for me, but whatever your face shape is, please do accordingly. For a lip liner, I'm using MAC, MAC Lip Liner in Cherry. going in with the Clinique Chubby Stick in Ro Rumious Rose. It's this beautiful mauve rose color. I absolutely love it. It feels so good on the lips too. Wow. This is the first time I'm trying this color. I absolutely love it. So let's get some highlight on. I almost forgot. I have a Laura Mercer palette here. I'm going to take a light dusting off, put it on the top of my cheeks, quickly just right above my eyebrows, give that a lift and a little bit on my chin for some extra glow. I'm using the Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder, my holy grail. Just put it in the places where you would be oily. And with that guys, you have here the finished look. So that was my look guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please leave me a comment down below and like this video and if you recreate it don't forget to tag me on hashtag asafara that's my instagram my twitter and instagram will be down below in the description box and also linked at the end be sure to add me let's keep in touch 
And if you haven't yet subscribed, I upload videos weekly, so what are you waiting for? Please subscribe. With that, I am going to dash because I am running late. And so I wish you a beautiful day or night, wherever you are. I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys!